the Honourable Member for Elmwood Transcona. Mr. Speaker, I rise today to recognize Concordia Hospital's 90 years of service to Northeast Winnipeg. In 1928, a group of newcomers came together to open a maternity hospital. It was such a success that it's been either moving or expanding ever since. It opened its current location in 1974 and since then has become a centre of excellence in hip and knee surgery. It opened Concordia Place, offering more personal care home beds to Northeast Winnipeg. And its emergency room has offered, offered needed care to people in crisis. Unfortunately, the provincial Conservative government plans to close the ER in the new year. Other ERs in Winnipeg have been replaced with urgent care centres, but for some reason, Northeast Winnipeg has been singled out to be the only part of the city losing 24-7 access to care. Yes. Mr. Speaker, I can tell you that people in Northeast Winnipeg have been pushing back. We deserve the same access to care as every other part of the city, and if the Conservatives cared at all about Northeast Winnipeg, they'd give their head a shake and keep the Concordia ER open. Yes. The Honourable Member for Spadina, Fort York.